Hey guys, this is just a quick tutorial on how to clean up your disk and get rid of any unnecessary or unused audio files. Um, and that's recommended that you only do this on sessions that you've definitely completed and finished with. Uh, don't do it on sessions you're in the middle of because you may need to come back and uh, refine a piece of an audio file at a later point. Um, so here's a Protoss session here. I'm using Protoss 8 at the moment, but this will work on earlier versions of Protoss as well. Um, the first thing we need to do is work out which audio files are actually being used in the arrange window, i.e. which files are here, which files are played when we play through the track. Um, if we go over to the bottom right hand corner here and we open up the regions list, you can see inside here we've got various um, audio files, stereo and um, some mono, um, there's some MIDI there as well. Now what we need to do is just click the little drop down arrow, uh, go on down to select unused audio files. If you click on that now what that will do is highlight any audio files that isn't used in the session. Like I, like I said, just reminding you that don't delete the files unless you're sure that you definitely do not need them. Um, once you've selected the files like that, you go back onto the drop down menu, you click clear and you can either remove them, which is removed from this session here, however we want to clear up some space on the hard drive, so we need to remove it from the entire hard drive, so if you click delete, and I want to say yes, you can also hold the alt key and click yes, and it would say yes to every um, repetition of that message. So now all these files that we have here are files which are in the arrange window here on the left, so any file we click here you'll see it being highlighted up on the left, up on the right, sorry there. So let's just save that and come out of uh, Pro Tools set. Let's just close that down. Here's the uh, folder which contains those session files. Um, now if you look inside, <coughs> we've actually now got just the audio files which belong to that session. Um, we've got the session file itself, uh, fade files, session backups and wave caches. If you need to upload um, files to uh, a website or an FTP server, um, the best thing to do is you can delete these three here, or any other files for that matter. Um, the only two that the um, Pro Tools user would need would be the session file and the audio file. Once they go and then reopen that up, they can regenerate the missing fade files. And then all the other files are there with inside the session and with inside the audio regions. And that's it. Hope that's really helpful and uh, good luck.